I can say is that it feels like more like a superhero. Um, so sometimes you'll see somebody who just sometimes just needs like a band-aid or someone who needs stitches. And then it goes to the extreme of someone who needs like resuscitation, who has a heart attack, or someone has a baby in the emergency department, or someone gets in a car accident. What happens is like you come in and you can't really tell what your day is going to be like. Uh, one day is different from the other. Uh, you get to see a lot of patients. You get to see, some days you don't see many patients, sometimes you just see six, six really, really sick patients, and some days you see like 50 patients that are like minor complaints. The emergency department is a very like complex place, like sometimes you come in as a patient and you're thinking like, no one is seeing you. So like one thing we can reassure you is that someone always knows about you, whether they might express it to you or not. There's like a system place in place, like someone knows what your vital signs are, what your complaint is. Sometimes you might see somebody get seen before you. It isn't because we're playing favoritism at all, it's just because that person's complaint could be on the verge of life threatening versus something that can be like devastating for them.